from the Vancouver Canucks, the Quebec Nordiques and the Vancouver Canucks, the parent clubs of the Fredericton Express. It'll be Chin and Lupo for the faceoff. Puck is dropped and we're underway now in period number one from the Civic Center. Off the faceoff. Here's Lupo now. Poke the puck into the skipjacks end, but Hotham's got it there. Swing it up now. Look out. Give away in the end. Here comes Lupo now on the left wing in the Baltimore zone. Lupo now centers one. That's out of the reach of Dave Bruce. Can't get to it. Now Bruce gets it back. Centers one. That's off a stick and Baltimore break back now. Two on two. Left wing to Loney. Cuts into the express zone. Lips one toward the goal. Poudry is there. Straight up around the near board. Hotham coming in now to hold it in. They jam up and on the right wing boards in the Baltimore zone. Puck comes out. Loney, can he hold it in? He cannot. And here come the express. Two on one. Over the line now. Crawford down the right side. Out of the reach of Dave Bruce. And Bruce is belted there by Troy Loney. Now Dahlquist hit by Crawford. And they stack it up now in the right wing corner of the Skipjacks in. And finally we get a little center, Tony Curry. And also Mike Stevens from the faceoff. Puck dropped. It'll roll on the left wing boards. We're after it now. Carlson trying to get it out. Can't do it. Curtin will hold it in. Now Carlson get it back from Wally Weir. Starts back three on two. Right wing to Belanche. He'll tip it toward the slot. Carlson now with a puck in the near corner. Right point, McDonnell. Slap shots kicked out by Wendell Young. Now it's loose in the goal mouth as Belanche had a swipe at it, but he fanned on the shot in front. And now the Express come back down the left side. Mike Huff with a blast, and that's stopped in front by Brian Ford. And now Ralston overskates the puck in his own zone. Can't get it out. Curtin holding it in now down the right wing boards. Now it's kicked to the right wing corner. Belanche and Huff collide there. But McDonnell will get the puck over to Carlson. And now out at center ice, out of the reach of Ralston. And it's back at the Fredericton Blue Line. Michelle Petit, defenseman, will take it away. Feeds it up over on the left side. Oh, Andy Schliebener, and he'll loft it into the skipjack zone. The Express has experienced players up front and on defense. And, of course, good goaltending. And that's all the ingredients you need to win. Charlesworth now in his own zone for Baltimore. Swings it ahead to... O'Regan, he flipped it over to Gatsos, but it went behind him. Loose puck now in the center circle. They got in over the line. Here comes Lanthier down the slot. Shot tipped on by Brian Ford. And he made a big save there on Jean-Marc Lanthier. Here comes O'Regan back for Gatsos and over the line. Wrist shot deflected on the way to the goal. By an express defenseman. It's up over the glass. Into the crowd. Change their lines up tonight. Trying to get something going offensively. And... Right now, he's got O'Regan, Simpson, and Gatsos up front. All right, puck poked back to center. Now, Bork will bring it in. Sliding it toward the goal. It's kicked aside by Wendell Young. In the near corner now, here's O'Regan after it. And now, Gatsos is also in there. Now, it's centered side of the goal. Poked away there by Tom Corrales. And the puck comes out. Look out, a two-on-one break. Here comes Lemieux. Cutting in down the left side. Shot! Score! Fredericton. Alain Lemieux just blasted it by Brian Ford. On the top of the left wing circle, I mean, that was a bullet. And Elaine Lemieux made goals, and they get five goals now and four assists for nine points. All right, it's 1 0 Fredericton as the Jacks shoot the puck into the express head. Here's Chin now shooting it behind the net. Nobody there for the Skipjacks. And now Fredericton will bring it out. Here's Schliebener now at center ice. Andy Schliebener crosses the red line and flips it in, right wing corner, Baltimore end. Ford will stick it away from Gary Lupel. Now it's out at the Jacks Blue Don. Here's Risling now. Carries the puck into the express zone. He'll put on the brakes now. Going to get back at the point to Hotham. Try to send the puck down the right wing board. Stolen away there by Fredericton. Here's Schliebener. Right wing to Lupel. Down the slot. Look out. Here's Crawford moving in. He couldn't get the shot away. Now it's centered, but Risling is there for the skip Jacks, and he'll just loft it up into the scores table there. And out of play. And Ralston on the ice now for... Jack's coach, Junior Briaco. Curtin facing it off with Huffman. Now it's back of the point. There's a shot up under the stands by Claude Julian. And look at a face off where? It'll be the top of the right wing circle in Skip Jack's territory. No other games tonight in the American Hockey League. Baltimore getting ready to host Rochester on Wednesday. Then the Jacks are going to be on the road for about a week. For three games, two in Rochester and one in St. Catharines. All right, puck dropped, and Melange will carry it to center, and accidentally flips the puck into the Skipjacks bench. Bill Brown, the Baltimore 
Associate Trainer alertly ducking away from that one. As we get a face-off now, it's on the Baltimore Blue Line. Carlson facing it off with Mark Curtin. Baltimore wins the draw. Flip it up on the right side of Belanger. It's by him, but it goes in the express territory. Now Belanger behind the goal, checked by Poudrier. Carlson now with a puck, trying to get back behind the net. Claude Julian racing after it. He'll leave it in behind his goal for Poudrier. Now Ralston checks him. He'll stuff it in front, but Andre at the side of the goal with a shot. And now Julian trying to move it out at center ice. Here he comes, head man pass on the minor to Curtin. Here's right wing feed for Curry. And Curry will chase it now on the right wing boards and skip Jack's territory, flip it back behind the Baltimore goal. Jack Donnell's got it there. Baltimore trying to move it out of their own zone over to Wally Weir. And out of Ralston, he's checked by Tony Curry. Now they're jamming up and on the right wing boards. Puck dug out there by Mike Hoff. He'll clear it behind the Jacks goal, but McDonnell with possession. Out to Carlson now. He'll just clear it back to the neutral zone. It's cleared right back into Jacks territory by Claude Julian. Five, uh, 15 minutes, 20 seconds to go here in the first period. It is 1-0 Fredericton. Ralston now steps to center. Had the puck taken away. The guy comes Lafayette in. John Mark Lafayette moving in. Can't get the shot away. Charles Worth with a good poke check from behind. Oak oh, checked the puck off the stick of Jean-Marc Lafayette was cruising in. And now up for Coach Andre Savard. O'Regan and Lafayette for the charge. Poke back at the left point. Schlieben and now wristing it toward the goal. Ford will knock it down. Lafayette in the rebound. Couldn't get a shot away. And now here's Bork getting it out at center ice. Shot back to the Baltimore line, but Charlesworth is there. He'll shoot it ahead to the Fredericton line. Now Gatso is with the puck. Tried to feed O'Regan in. Couldn't do it. Play broken up, and now Lemieux comes back. Here's Elaine Lemieux cutting in down the right side, but he can't get a shot away. And now it's behind the net. With the puck now, Phil Bork. And he'll feed it up on the right side to Gatso. Slap shot just over the goal mouth. Now Regan will tip it in behind the net. After the puck there, Michelle Petit. Simpson checking him. Gatso's now going to get back at the right point to Bork. Stopping it toward the goal. Deflected there and away from the net by Michelle Petit. And Schliebener getting it out to... John Mark Goland, now they got Lemieux over the line, shot, he missed the goal. Boy, Lane Lemieux looks like he came to play tonight. Here's Bork now with a puck. Out at center ice, out of the reach of Tom O'Regan. And back deep in the express zone. Tom Corrales going back to get it there. Corrales now, feed it up on the right side, out of the reach of Petit. Now the loose puck at center ice, gathered in by Fredericton. Here's Dave Bruce down the left side for Mark Crawford. Crawford now, centers one. Lupa with a poke at it, but right there to take it away was Troy Loney. And he'll send Giel away at center ice. Here comes Bobby Giel, and over the line, down the left side, Giel had the puck taken away by Dave Bruce. Now look out, there's a giveaway by Corrales. Down the right side is Troy Loney with the puck working hard. Only now in the near corner, tied up. Now the puck taken by Colin Chin. Here's Chin now, side of the goal to Loney, walking in, trying to slide the puck over to Giel. But it was grabbed there, side of the net by Claude Julian. Now look out, the puck out at center ice with the express. Here comes Dave Bruce, one man to beat Dahlquist. Bruce cut again. He's knocked off his skates by Chris Dahlquist. And the Jacks have the puck now. Bobby Giel out at center just to take a call and chin. And it's back at the Fredericton Blue Line. Mark Crawford now with the puck. Had it taken away. And Ralston now will flip it into the express zone. Back behind the net. Wendell Young will stop it there. For Tom Corrales. Corrales now. Can he get it out? He will. Out at center. Left side to Mark Crawford. His right wing feed on the mighty Curry with a wrist shot right on. Ford will knock it down. And McDonnell with a rebound. Here he comes, three on three. Joe McDonnell now will carry the puck in, cutting down the left side. McDonnell goes behind the goal. Centers one. Belanger couldn't get to it. Roger Belanger now is checked. And Petit will come out with a puck. Swing up on the left side. Weir tried to hold it in, but just could not do it. It squirts back to center. All right, McDonnell now at his own blue line. To Carlson, over the line to Ralston, broken up with the express blue nine by Petit. Weir now will carry it in. We have an offside call here against the Skipjacks. 12-15 to go here. Express club on top here. Carlson facing it off now with Mark Curtin, top of the right wing circle, skip Jack zone. And the Jacks win the draw. Carlson over to Bork, pass ahead to Belanger off his stick. It's back at center. Bork will gather it in there. Wait for Belanger to clear the zone. Now he flips it in back behind the Fredericton net. Here's Curtin now. 
Getting away from a Charlesworth check and clearing it back into Baltimore Ice and Bork rushing back to get it. Getting away from Mike Huff. And now Ralston looks for skating room. He'll bang it off the glass. And it's taken away at center by Cur Tony Curry. He comes back in, but Fredericton couldn't clear the zone in time. We get a whistle dropped. It'll go back to the Baltimore defense. Hotham there's got the puck. Now Dahlquist trying to clear it ahead. It's loose now at the Jacks blue line. Finally, Fredericton will clear it in. Ball's back deep now in Baltimore territory. Here's Hotham. Swinging up now on the left side. Simpsons pass ahead out of the reach. And the Express come back in now. Down the left side. Here's Stevens. Tried to center one for McIntyre, but McIntyre was tied up by Simpson. And Baltimore breaks back. Here comes Tom O'Regan. Down the left side now. O'Regan centers one back for Gatsos. Top of the left wing circle. Gatsos now flip it back behind the goal. Gathering in there for the Express is Danielle Poudrier. And now it's fired back into Baltimore territory, and Ford will spin it away for Dahlquist. Dahlquist now on the right wing to Gatsos. And now ahead, here comes Simpson now, two on two, into the zone, down the right side, Davy Simpson with a puck. Then there's one for O'Regan, he tips it above the express net. Let's see here, a whistle. And we have a penalty. Or an injured player, or on the express blue line, Chin. And Elaine Lemieux with the puck drop, and Fredericton has it. Here's Lanthier now. Trying to send in Jean-Marc Golan, but that's broken up with the Jacks blue line. And now Golan will get it back at center ice. Here's Jean-Marc Golan now. Wheeling through center. Off his stick. He off the skates he goes. Chin knocked him down. And we got a penalty coming up here against Baltimore. Colin Chin upended Jean-Marc Golan. Tim Minnelli back with you at the Baltimore Civic Center. Fredericton about set to go on the power play here. They have 18 power play goals and 101 opportunities. Their power play unit clicking at an 18% efficiency. Baltimore penalty killing. They've given up 25 power play goals. And opponents 125 chances. They're killing off penalties at an 80% efficiency rate. All right, Tony Curry now coming in over the line, but Huff was offside. And we'll face it off outside the Jacks blue line. Well, Mitch Lamoureux will be back in the Baltimore lineup on Wednesday. He's serving the final game of a four-game suspension tonight. And so he's back in the Jacks lineup on Wednesday when Baltimore hosts Rochester here at the Civic Center. And the kill for Baltimore, Steve Carlson, Bob Geel, Carlson, and Lupo for the draw. And the puck cleared back into the skip Jacks end. Now Huff with a puck down on the left wing. Mike Huff with a puck. At the right point to Claude Julian. Out of the left point now. Back to Julian, center point. It's back of the left point to Elaine Lemieux. Far boards Lupul. Center point Lemieux. Here comes the drive. It's blocked in front by Carlson. And he'll find the opening and shoot it down ice. Not many penalty killing chances go by that Steve Carlson doesn't block at least one shot. He got his quota for this. Opponent's power play. Here comes Lupo now. They'll flip it in right wing boards. Skip Jackson. It'll roll behind the net. Here's Ford. Leaving it for Hotham. Now Dahlquist grabs it to the line. Not out. Held in by Lemieux. And Carlson will steal it away. And they pass to Lemieux. And he fire it down ice. By the way, if you're wondering, Elaine Lemieux, is he the brother of Mario Lemieux of the Penguins? And yes, he is the brother of the very talented Penguin centerman. All right. Here comes Fredericton now. Breaking out of their own end. Crawford now into the zone. Got to feed it down the left side for McIntyre. He'll get it behind the goal. They got loose pucks out of the net. Here comes McIntyre trying to get that puck and cut in, but Ford will be able to smother it there, side of his net. And we'll get a whistle now on a face-off. Tryouts. Giel, a, what they call a PTO, a professional tryout, since he's played in the league for a number of years. And Chen is a amateur tryout for 25 games. And so a decision will have to be made by the Penguins and the Skipjacks. They're going to sign both of those two for the remainder of the season. Baltimore from the draw clears it back to center. And the puck taken now by Michelle Petit. All right, here he comes. Trying to feed it right side to McIntyre. Broken up again by Baltimore. And here's Loney steering it back to the Fredericton Blue Nine. Now Michelle Petit with a puck. Trying to golf it in. Hit his own man, Crawford. It's back to center. Eight seconds to go and the penalty now to Colin Chin. Here comes Petit. Tried to shoot it in for Crawford out of his stick and out of his reach. As Chin back on the ice now with Express to look at the puck on the Baltimore end. Now it's centered. Nobody there. 
as Crawford was tied up by Dahlquist in the slot. Here's O'Regan, can't get it out, held in by Schliebener. He'll steer it behind the Jacks net. Crawford and Hothamgall go to the boards. Al Loney steps into Ken Quinney as he's checked. Loose puck now behind the Jacks goal, picked off by Greg Hotham. We have eight minutes left now in period number one. Pass ahead for O'Regan, out of his reach. Get her all the way down to the Fredericton zone. Andy Schliebener now with a puck. Hangs it off the boards. Ahead for one of the Express players, Mike Stevens, but he couldn't get to it. Now Bobby Gee will take over. Here's Gee into the zone, but it's offside. Skipjacks and a very late call there as well. Gee was a scorer on this Fredericton club. All right from the draw, here comes Bobby Gee now. In down the right wing, Bobby Gill goes behind the express net. Bumped off the puck, now Rizzling getting it. He is checked. Buck finally gathered in now, dangerously in front of his own net. Here's Daniel Poudrier, but the express able to get it out. Here comes Dave Bruce into the zone. Bruce, wrist shot blocked by Todd Charlesworth there. Now Bruce on the near board, centers one, but Rizzling alertly grabs it and takes it away from Mark Curtin. Rizzling now right wing for Bobby Gill. Poudrier tied him up, and the puck now in the express zone. Clear to the line, outside the line, and back at the Jacks' blue line. Todd Charlesworth back to get it now. Phil Bork swinging up right wing. It's off his stick and taken now by the Express. Here's Julian. Over the line now for Mark Stevens. We're going to get an icing to the right of Wendell Young. We haven't seen much action here in this game thus far. All right, puck drop. At the side of the goal, picked up now by Michel Petit. He gave the puck to Belanger. His backhander stopped in front. Now Carlson jamming up and on the near boards with Lafayette. It's back at the point. McDonnell, the wrist shot, sticked aside there by Wendell Young. And Young will try to clear up the near boards. Carlson stealing, sending it back to the express end. And now Schliebener, can he get it out? He will to center. Now Weir had it stolen away by Elaine Lemieux, and he had to haul Lemieux down. And a penalty coming up here against Baltimore's Wally Weir. Elaine Lemieux looked for that loose puck, and he got it. And Weir had to take him down. So the Express coming up here with another power play opportunity. 6.17 to go here in the first period. Our score, Frederick. Two. Back live with the Civic Center. It is Fredericton now on the power plays. We are in the penalty box for interference at 13.43. All right, the Express now with a puck. Up ice. John Mark Lanthier lost it. Puck is loose, and who's got it here? Andy Schliebener had the puck. Edgewood High School students who are here in a big way tonight, cheering across the way for the Skipjacks. Trying to get Baltimore to cut off this. Fredericton power play. All right, the Express now with a puck off the draw on their own end. Here goes Claude Julian. He was a big play man in the 4-1 win by the Express over Baltimore back on October the 30th. All right, over the line now. Here comes Tony Curry down the right wing. Checked by Dahlquist. Curry and Dahlquist collide. They go to the left rear boards. Now Mike Huff checked. Chris Dahlquist, they fire it toward the goal. Now we get a whistle here. The puck caught beneath the pads of Ottawa goaltender Brian Ford is Carlson. To the left of Brian Ford. Puck dropped. It'll go to the right point now with a puck. Elaine Lemieux. He's getting on the blue line now. Now it's at the center point. Lemieux fakes the shot. Right wing points to Julian. His drive and was steered all the way to center ice. Carrying up the boards back to center. And now with the puck, here comes Gary Lupo. Over the line to Curry. Back for Lupo now. Top of the right wing circle. Here is Gary Lupo now going behind the goal for Curry. Tony Curry now trying to stuff it in front, but gave the puck right to Bobby Geel. And Geel now will move up ice. Geel, slap shot from center. Stopped by Young. He got a piece of it. And he will leave it now behind his own goal for Claude Julian. All right, now they got left wing to Huff. Here's Huff now. Now they get back to Lupo. Top of the left wing circle. Back for Huff now. Near corner, Baltimore zone. Huff now. Center point, Petit shot, fired it wide of the Baltimore goal. The rebound will bounce back, and Brian Ford will grab it there. 
And we're going to get a face off here again in the skipjack zone. We're down to 419 left. On the left wing, on the right side, Mark Crawford. All right, puck dropped, and now Dahlquist will try to bring it out, and he'll do so out at center. We are now out of the penalty box, and we are back at equal strength. All right, Fredericton now with the puck in their own zone. Pass ahead, out of the reach of Crawford. Dahlquist now feeding it over the line to Colin Chin. Chin gets around his man, now will fire it toward the goal. As he was upended, it was wide of the net. Now Ralston now on the near boards. Going to get back at the point to Hotham. He'll dump it back behind the express net. Now Chin in the far corner, and he's rams with Ken Quinney. They stack it up and on the left wing boards, and apparently they puck frozen beneath Quinney and Chin. And we'll face it off now in the Fredericton zone in the left wing circle. All right, Chin now moving in with Mark Curtin. Baltimore has not had much going here offensively in period one. They've had to kill off a couple of penalties, but not much offense even when they were playing at equal strength. From the draw. And the Express has the puck. Here is Daniel Poudry at his own zone. Firing it right wing out of the reach of Tony Curry. It'll roll off the boards back into Baltimore territory. Greg Hotham going back to get it. He's checked in the near corner. Now they stack it up. Mike Hoff will dig it out. Huff now tried to center one, but Chin blocked it. Now they jam up along the left rear boards. Puck comes out at the point now. Poudre at top of the left wing circle. Couldn't tee it up. He'll shoot it back behind the Baltimore goal. On the far boards, Curtin and Dahlquist fighting for the puck. Now Huff grabs it. Huff back at the point. On the far boards now. Jack's trying to get it out. Huff knocks down Colin Chin. And they're going to freeze it now in the skipjack zone. As Chin knocked the skipjack zone. Off the draw, it comes to Andy Sleevener. Moves in a shot glove by Brian Ford. And he'll leave it off for Wally Weir. Now Gatsos on the right wing. Feeding it out to O'Regan. Here's Tommy O'Regan now with a puck. Right side to Gatsos. He'll chase it in deep in express territory. Behind the net now. Here is Simpson jamming with Schliebener. Puck rolls to the near corner. Lemieux and O'Regan fight for the puck. They're trying to dig it out of there now. Here's O'Regan digging along the near boards. Along with Simpson. And now they finally freeze it. And we'll get a face off in the Fredericton zone this time. All right, they're moving in. It's in the slot. Here's O'Regan now with a poke at it. Along with Simpson, but it's poked away. And now in the near corner, Schlieven are trying to move it out. And he'll just loft it back to the Jacks' blue line. And Wally Weir's on it there. Over to Tom O'Regan. Right wing to Gatsos, into the zone now. Here comes Gatsos, trying to get it down the slot for O'Regan. But a good defensive play by Andy Schliebener took it away. Now a poke by Simpson, but couldn't get a shot away. And the Express now with a puck. In their own zone now, here comes Elaine Lemieux with a full head of steam to center. Into the Baltimore zone, here's Lemieux down the left side, trying to get the puck in front to Jean-Marc Golan, but they can't do it. Now Golan, double team, look out, puck centered at the side of the goal. Here is Ford jumping on it there. And we'll get a face-off now in the Baltimore zone. We are back live at the Baltimore Civic Center as the Skipjack shoot the puck into the Fredericton end. It's cleared right back out again by the Express all the way down ice. Should get icing here. Bork going back to get it. He touches. Has not seen much action here in this first period. All right, Ralston moving in now. His face off with Gary Lupul. Puck rolls to the right wing corner. And Ed Poudrier trying to get it out. Now Baltimore steals and centers, but Lupul is there. Now in the right wing corner, Lupul trying to get it out. Can he do it? He cannot. Charlesworth holding it in momentarily, but now it comes outside the line. And here comes Gary Lupul trying to pick it up with the puck hit the linesman, Gary Matson there. And Tom Ralston now will gather it in. Right side of it on Jay, but it hops off his stick up into the penalty box area. And we'll get a face off now at center ice. Last minute of play, period number one. It is Fredericton one and Baltimore nothing, and this is Skip Jacks Hockey on AM 1230 WITH.
Tim Vanelli back with you at the Baltimore Civic Center. Last minute of play here in period number one. Here's Mike Huff now in the corner, cutting toward the goal. But he was bumped off the puck, and now the Jacks have it. Here's Chris Dahlquist now, a long slap shot from center. A bouncing puck, stopped by the pads of Wendell Young. And the Express now clear it back to center. Hotham fires it back in, puck knocked down there by Petit. Delayed offside here against Baltimore. Puck taken by Schliebener. Out of his own end, Schliebener now flips it in, right wing corner, skip Jack zone. O'Regan going back to get it, flipping it up on the far boards to Loney. Loney is checked, puck comes free. At the right point now, Petit. Left point to Schliebener, Rister toward the goal is wide. Now Curtin's after the puck, and he'll get it back behind the net. Now Dahlquist with some skating room will bring it out here. Bobby Giel now at center ice, slap shot there. Wide of the goal was the buzzer sounds, ending period number one. So, staff of the and others. Some of the Tigers coaches frequently come down and see the Skipjacks games, notably their defensive coordinator, Gordy Combs, who did a good job with the Tigers defense this year. Meanwhile, back to the ice game. It's the Express in Baltimore tangling here tonight with the Express on the lead, 1 0. Buck is dropped, we're underway now in period number two. Buck now in the Skipjack zone. Baltimore trying to get it out. Here's Bonanje down on the near boards, trying to poke it up the right wing boards, but it is Fredericton holding it in right now. Now a steal for Mark Crawford. He's closing in, a shot, and he fired it wide. Like that Dave Bruce with a drive. Now on the near boards, here is Dahlquist getting it back behind his net to Steve Carlson. Carlson out of the line, can't get it out. Crawford now will hold it in. Mark Crawford now on the left wing boards. Now a steal in front, the wrist shot by Bruce, right on, and Brian Ford will glove it there. And hang on for the faceoff. And one of the linesmen just did a nice, and now for Fredericton, it's Mark Curtin now into the faceoff circle. Facing it off with Tom O'Regan, and O'Regan wins the draw back to McDonnell, but Mack fell down back there. Now he's going to freeze the puck. And we'll get a whistle on a faceoff coming up in the skipjack zone. The trivia question tonight, being passed it on to our audience here at the Civic Center. Two current skipjacks players saw action in three different leagues last season. Who were they? See if you can guess at home. We'll give you the answer here in a couple of moments. All right, from the faceoff, Baltimore stacking it up now with the Express in the right wing corner. Mike Hoff and Wally Weir in there. Lost a little bit surprised he's down here with Fredericton. As the puck is dropped, and here comes Tom O'Regan now. Working it up ice. Down the right wing. He'll tap it behind the goal. Giel's after, but he's tied up. Can't get a hand on the puck. Now Loney in the near corner. Tied up by Tony Curry. Loney getting it free now to Wally Weir. Weir back behind the net to Loney. Loney now trying to toss it back behind the goal to Giel, but it deflects up into the stands. Behind the Skipjacks goal, we're going to get a faceoff here as Curtin will move in now with Tom O'Regan for the faceoff. Buck is dropped. And O'Regan trying to get a swipe at it, but could not do it, and the Express come back. Right wing to Curtin. Here's Curtin now into Baltimore territory. Goes behind the goal, centered one. Well, one of the Express players took a tumble as so O'Regan had the wraps. December the 6th, the Jacks and the Hershey Bears and tote bag night. Sponsored by Rohrbaugh's Charter Service. Tote bag to the first 3,000 women and their fans, 14 years of age and under. Off the draw and out. The Express now with a puck in the Edrington zone. Now Gatsos chases down the loose puck on the, on the right wing boards. Chin now. Had it poke checked off his stick by Elaine Lemieux. And it's the Express back up ice. Here's Jean-Marc Golan. Into the zone now. He's bumped by Rizzling. Now in the slot. Legat Lemieux closing in. But Charlesworth got his stick on that to deflect it up into the stands. Elaine Lemieux. Look, Jean-Marc Golan on the right side. And Jean-Marc Lanthier on the left. A few Jean-Marcs on the ice right now. As the Jacks win the faceoff. Gary Rizzling, the chin. Into the zone. Chin shot. Top of the left wing circle. Wide of the goal. Now Gatsos is after behind the net. Now the chin side of the goal. Chin now. Try to slide the puck in front of Gatsos. He took a swipe at it, but that was blocked by Wendell Young. In the far corner now. Puck to the line. Not out. Baltimore holding it in. Down the slot. Here's a drive by Bork. It's blocked on the way to the goal. Now in the near corner. Puck taken by Jean-Marc Lanthier. He cannot get it out. Held in momentarily by Baltimore, but now Jean-Marc Golan with a puck coming back. With Lemieux trailing. Here's Golan. Into the zone. Top of the circle, but he's bumped off the puck by Todd Charlesworth. And Phil Bork will bring it back. 
Up the ice to Carlin Chan, getting around Claude Julian. Here's Chin now, went over the line. Chin dropping it off to Gatsos, winding up, shot, missed the goal. Rizzling now in the near corner. Gary Rizzling fired back the other way to Gatsos. Gatsos checked by Lemieux, lost the puck. And Elaine Lemieux starts back for Fredericton. At center, he'll just loft it in. Now the left wing boards in the skipjack zone. And Steve Carlson back to get it. I will let up side for Rissling. He'll tap it to center. Puck picked up there by Michelle Petit. Knocked down at the Baltimore Blue Line by Carlson. And we get the high stick call there against the... here looking for the first goal of the game for them we face it off now top of the right wing circle skip jack zone Carlson and Lupel and Carlson will win the draw Dahlquist fires it ahead but the Express has possession they'll fire it back into the skip jack zone here's Hoffman now off the boards up to Carlson at center two on two Carlson feeds in Ralston down the left side here's Ralston now moving in in front couldn't get a shot away now Dahlquist kind of backhanded in but wait a minute we got a whistle here and a penalty coming up against Fredericton When Ralston cut toward the net, Schliebener slashed him, scoring in the power play almost 20% of the time. As Schliebener is off for slashing at 4.05 for Fredericton. Baltimore in the power play now. Carlson with Ralston and Belanche up front. O'Regan and McDonnell back at the points. From the jaw, O'Regan grabs the puck now at the blue line, shooting it back behind the net. Here is Julian steering the puck to the near point. O'Regan holding it in. Back behind the net now to Carlson, trying to stuff it in front. Loose puck, side of the goal. Wait a minute here, whistle. And they say the puck was knocked down with a high stick by the Skipjacks. They have Mark Curtin and Mike Huff out there in the penalty killing unit, along with Claude Julian and Daniel Poudrier. Carlson now with Ralston and Belange still on the ice now in the power play. Puck drop. Roger Belange with a disc now in his own zone. Here come the Jacks up ice, looking for their first goal of the game. Belange now will carry the puck into the Express zone, but Mike Huff back checking took it away. But before they can get going here, we get a whistle offside skipjacks. Junior Briaco now with a fresh set of forwards. It's going to be Steve Gatsos, Dave Simpson, and Troy Loney up front. McDonnell and O'Regan are going to stay back and play defense right now. As the faceoff coming up just outside the Fredericton Blue Line between Mark Curtin and Dave Simpson. They move in now, the faceoff. Off the jaw, Simpson wins it, but a whistle. Apparently a couple of players not lined up properly for the faceoff. We'll have to drop it again here. Simpson and Curtin. And Simpson wins it again. Clears it right side to McDonnell. He'll blast the puck into the Fredericton zone. In a roll around the near boards. Here's Gatsos with a puck. Tell it to Simpson. And Loney in front could not get in the puck. Now Loney pokes it back. Right point, McDonnell shot. That hit Young in the slot. Now Simpson goes behind the goal, trying to stuff it in front for Loney. Couldn't do it. Now Gatsos now at the left point. Here is Gatsos now. Near boards to Simpson. Left point O'Regan. Slap shot toward the goal. Blocked in front by Mark Kurt. Loney now trying to get it back to Gatsos and does so. Julian checking him. Now it's back to Loney. Left wing corner. Loney now left point O'Regan. Right point to McDonnell. Wristing it toward the goal and Loney just to fail to tip it wide there. Now with a puck. Here come the Express. They bang it off the wood at center but it's stolen away by Gatsos. Steve Gatsos now wheels back in over the line, tried to feed Simpson left wing. That's broken up. Now O'Regan comes in, and he'll tip the puck to the left wing corner. Simpson racing it after. Here is Claude Julian, and he'll get it by Tom O'Regan at the blue dot. It's all the way back into the skipjack zone. 27 seconds to go here on the penalty to Andy Schliebener. Baltimore in the power play here, trying to get a goal in this second period. As Simpson comes up ice. Simpson now over to Gatsos, across the line to Loney. Here's Troy moving in with a quick wrist shot. And Young got a piece of that to deflect it up under the stands. We played five minutes and 54 seconds of the second period. It is 1-0 Fredericton. On the faceoff now, Rizzling at the point to Bork. Rister toward the goal, right on. Young will stop it. And the loose puck taken now by Tom Corrales. He can't get it out. Kept in now by the Skipjacks. Here's Giel, top of the left wing circle, but the Express are able to get it up ice now. As Schliebener back on, we're back at equal strength. 
Work now and behind his own goal. Spins away from Mark Crawford. And now Charlesworth, right wing feed out of the reach of Bobby Geal. It's going to roll deep into the express zone. Back to get it to Corrales. He touches. And we have the icing call here. Tim Danelli back with you at the Civic Center. Chin now over the line. Here comes Colin Chin moving in. Chin, top of the left wing circle, trying to make a move toward the goal, but Schliebener finally took him off the puck. Now Chin back after that loose puck. Here comes Gary Risling now to join, but it's kick free. Now Chin grabs it. He's upended. No penalty. It's back of the left point. Charlesworth. Worcester toward the goal. Blocked by Wendell Young. He got a glove on that shot. Baltimore picks things up offensively here in the second period. As the Express will fire the puck down ice. Uh, Charlesworth back to get it now. The Express on the lead here, one to nothing. Charlesworth back into his own zone now with a puck look out. Lanthier almost stole it away. Now Lanthier and Charlesworth go for the puck. Finally, it's Carlson getting it out of center. Here comes Phil Bork. Right wing to Giel. Giel on the right side. Not only upcoming here against Michel Petit as Bork was cutting toward the goal. Petit took him down. And we have a holding call coming up here against the Express. Power play 0 for 1 on the power play thus far in the game. As Ralston, Carlson, and Belanger are up front. Curtin and Ralston for the faceoff, and Curtin wins it. Back behind the goal. Now Baltimore forechecking. Here's Ralston and Belanger. After the puck, Belanger now. Send it to the far corner now. Tom Ralston with a puck. Baltimore sending up now on the power play. Ralston, right point to McDonnell. Left point O'Regan in the slot for Ralston. Couldn't get a shot away, and the puck hops over the stick of Joe McDonnell and goes back to center. Pass ahead, Tommy Ralston can't control it. It's back deep in the express zone. Julian now bumped off the puck by Carlson and Roger Belanger. Now at the right point, here's McDonnell with a blast. That's stopped in front by Wendell Young. Ralston now with a puck. Tommy Ralston getting it back behind the goal to Belanger. Belanger now trying to cut in front, but it's poke checked off his stick by Claude Julian. Puck comes now, left point O'Regan. Out of Belanger, but he could not control the puck. And Julian will get it back into Baltimore territory. All right, it's back deep in the jack zone. Now here's Lupo forechecking. But Tom O'Regan pokes it free. Look out, Lupo almost stole it away. Shot in front, blocked by O'Regan. Lupo almost had a shorthanded goal there. 51 seconds left on the penalty. Now Lupo steals the puck from McDonnell. He'll backhand it right back deep. And skip jack's territory. And do I hear a few bluebirds here or what? Jacks now with a puck deep in their own zone. 34 seconds left on the penalty to Lemieux. As Simpson now has some skating room. He'll bring it out at center ice. Simpson now across the express line. Simpson now down the slot. Puck taken away, however. And Schliebener will find the opening and dish it down ice. Off and back to get it now. Chance for one last quick rush here in the power play. It is Fredericton 1, Baltimore nothing here. Loney now with a puck in the neutral zone. Into the express end. Here he comes, moving in, trying to get a shot away. He cannot do it. Like on Gatso's side of the goal. With a poke off that bouncing puck, but Young will grab it there. And he will hang on for the faceoff with just two seconds remaining on the you pardon. Dave Simpson facing it off with Mark Curtin. Simpson going to get back to Gatso's. His shot deflected on the way to the goal. Lemieux is back on. We're back at equal strength now. Here come the Express up ice. Curtin now, three on two rush. Right side Petit. Petit moving in, a shot kicked out by Brian Ford. He tried to fire it again toward the goal, hit the side of the net. Now Gatsos will pick it up at center. Gatsos to Simpson. And over the line, but wrestling is offside down the left wing. And so, Doug McIntyre outside the Express Blue Dot is back in the Edgerton zone. Wait a minute here, we got a whistle. And let's see. Going off for hooking. And the time of the penalty is 9.42 of period number two. So we have four skaters and a goaltender here for each club for the next two minutes. Bork now with a shot from the right point. And that's stopped by Wendell Young. And the rebound cleared back into Baltimore Ice. Charles Worth hustling back to get it here. Up to O'Regan. He is checked. Lost the puck now. Lupo. And he get back at the point to Corrales. His shot. Brian Ford will stop it there. Juggles, but is able to hang on for the faceoff. Tom Corrales looking for his third goal of the season. As the Express got the puck in the skipjack zone. 
And Corrales got set up there at the left point. He fired one. Ford made the stop. He juggled the rebound momentarily, but then able to come up with it. And so a face-off here in the left wing circle of Skipjack's territory. All right, puck dropped. It'll go behind the Baltimore goal, and Phil Bork's got the disc there. Work now to Charles Worth. Out to O'Regan now at his own blue dot. Here comes Tommy O'Regan with a puck. He'll backhand it in, knocked down by Julian. And now he'll shoot it up ice for Lupo, but it's out of his reach, and bang, back to the neutral zone. Julian now bumped by Bobby Geel. A puck to flex back to the express blue dot. Tom Corrales now with a puck. Over to Julian now in his own zone. Up on the right side of Quinney. And now ahead to Lupo. One man to beat, Bork. Lupo into the zone. Here's Lupo now. Drop past Corrales in the top of the left wing circle. Shot. That's blocked by Bobby Gill deflecting up into the crowd. Now Lupo and Bork are going to drop their gloves, and they're going to go at it now. In the skipjack zone. Gary Lupo and Phil Bork dropping their gloves. That's one of the more exciting... From the faceoff at the Baltimore Blue Don. Jacks have the puck now. Wally Weir and back behind his own net. Weir now will carry it out of his own zone. Feeds it up on the left side to Tom Ralston. Can't get around Michelle Petit. Petit bumps him off the puck. And now Lanthier knocked down at the Express Blue Don by Troy Loney. Puck back at the right point. Here's McDonnell holding it in. In front for Loney. Tips it on. Save. Rebound. Loney dumped in the goal mouth and a penalty coming up here against Fredericton. Good play by Joe McDonnell. He saw Loney was open in front of the goal. Got it to him. Those has been the big gun thus far in the power play for the Jacks. Seven power play goals. From the draw, here's O'Regan now to that point. Back for Ralston, but they puck deflected on a good play by Mark Curtin back to center. And Gatsos has it there. Ottawa now trying to spread things out. Now Gatsos had his pass taken away by Mark Curtin. And Junior Briaco upset down below. And Baltimore to get something going here. And the puck cleared back deep in Jack's territory. Here's McDonnell getting away from Mark Curtin. And he'll spring it up ice to Ralston out of his reach, and it's driven all the way back into the Fredericton zone. And again, Junior Briaco trying to clap and get some encouragement going here. All right, penalty's over now to Simpson and McIntyre. It's a five-on-four power play. Here comes O'Regan in down the left wing, but he has checked. Mike Huff gets the puck. And fires at the length of the ice. 1.12 to go on the Baltimore power play. Here comes Ralston now in his own zone. Feeds it over to Tom O'Regan. Into the Fredericton end. Now to Gatsos. Right point now to McDonnell. McDonnell holding it up, trying to get it down the right wing boards. Now Simpson in the slot. Here comes Simpson. Left point to O'Regan. The wrist shot right on. Save made there. And Huff gets to the puck first and clears it down ice. Hey, if Baltimore is not getting... Second and third shots. They're getting one, and that's it right now. 41 seconds to go on the penalty to Michelle Petit. All right, McDonnell now will work the puck to center. Here comes Mack, and he'll wrist it in down the right wing boards, deep in express territory. Here is Loney in there trying to hold it in. Carlson now at the right point to Hotham, driving it toward the net. Stopped in front, rebound, but Andre a poke at it. Now Carlson, a shot right on save. Rebound, Hotham now back at the point, his shot blocked in front. Loney now side of the net. To haunt them his drive, save, rebound! Belange shoots and scores! And the Jacks finally get on the scoreboard here. As Belange poked home the rebound by Wendell Young. And that's what Baltimore needed. Was it a power play? But Andre gets the goal. We're tied up at one goal apiece here. Let's see if that breathes some life into the skipjacks here. All right, puck drop. And the Express now will bring it in. Ralston now behind the goal. Out of Carlson. Can he get it out? No, he can't. But T checks in. Now Ralston will dig it out. Here he comes. Carlson now with Belange. They'll give it right wing to Roger. Into the zone now. Belange. Stop shot. He missed the net. And the loose puck will carry him all the way back into the neutral zone. Hotham's on it there. He'll slap it right back into the Express end. Now down the left side, here's Tommy Ralston with a puck. Trying to get it back behind his goal. The Express break out, here they come. Two on two. Lafayette now coming in, moving in the wrist shot. Hotham had it, tied up, and it went wide of the net. Here's Goldan now, checked by 
Dahlquist. Now Jean-Marc Lanthier with a puck. He gave it right to Steve Carlson. Carlson will send Belanger at center. He'll just wrist it in on the net. And Young will grab it. Mask high. And he'll get it up ice to Jean-Marc Golan. And now to Elaine Lemieux, and he'll slip it into Baltimore territory. Stopped the side of the goal by Brian Ford. And now here is Wally Weir. On the line, not out. Held in now down the left side by Poudrier. It's shot behind the Jacks goal. Ford will poke check it away and up to Simpson. And he will shoot the puck back to the Express Blue Line. Poudrier now is pass ahead, stolen away by Colin Chan. Here comes Chan down the left side. Try to set up Simpson in the slot, but that's taken away by Claude Julian. He'll bang it off the wood and back to center. Now over the line, McDonnell down the slot for Simpson. Here comes Simpson now with a puck. Holds up the brakes. Side of the goal to Gatsos and hopped over a stick. Far courts now. Colin Chin with a puck. Now Simpson behind the net. Bump by Poudrier. Simpson trying to dig it free back there. Poudrier's got it. He'll swing it up the boards and McDonnell couldn't hold it in. It's back outside the line. Race for the puck now. In the zone, here comes Ken Quinney. Trying to slide the puck in front, but it rolls on net. And Ford will grab it there and hang on for the faceoff. Working well, and the Skipjacks have the man advantage. All right, from the draw now, the Baltimore zone face off. It rolls right to the goal mouth, and Ford will smother it there. And we'll get a face off here in the right wing circle of Skipjacks territory. 5 0 5 to play here in the second period. We're tied at one goal apiece. Low scoring, tight checking game tonight. From the draw, Charlesworth now will pull the puck out of the circle. Here he comes up ice. He'll try to backhand it in, couldn't do it. In an express player, it's back outside the line to center. Hotham waits for his teammates to clear the zone. Now fires it back into the express end. Now the left wing boards now. Here's O'Regan with a puck. At the Fredericton blue line. Now Curry steals. Here's Tony Curry. Into the zone. Trying to get around Hotham. Momentarily does. Curry now. Feeding it back to Huff. His shot. Ford stopped that. Huff now. Back of the left point to Schliebener. He'll hold it in. But now the Jacks have it. Here's O'Regan now. Trying to swing it over to the left wing to Bobby Geal. But it's Fredericton with a steal. Now the left wing to Curry. Into the Baltimore end. Curry tied up by Hotham. Buck still loose now. Huff trying to center one for Curtin. Look out. Man in front. Here's Petit. Turns around. Fires one. It just dribbled wide of the net. Now Baltimore going to fire it up by so Regan grabs it. Two on three. Here's O'Regan with a long slap shot from the express blue line. Knocked down by Wendell Young. Now it's centered back, but right there to take it away is Michelle Petit. Puts it up on the stick of Mike Huff. Huff now will just loft it in down the right wing boards in Baltimore territory. And we're going back to get it. It is Fredericton now changing on the fly. We are back at his own blue line trying to move the puck through center ice. He'll give it up to Bobby Geal. And he'll shoot it in, but it's poke check back to center. Now Carlson moving back in, but Baltimore's offside at the Fredericton blue line. All right, we're back to action here. While we were away, Steve Carlson just missed an open out of the backhand. And I got it. Here comes Elaine Lemieux. He's closing in. A shot save. Rebound. And Gauline couldn't get to it. Now it's back at the left point now. Held into the Baltimore zone by Poudrier. And in the near corner now, here is Risling. They get back to the Fredericton blue line. Poudrier on it there. Now it's loose at center ice. Buck taken by Poudrier. Over the line now to Elaine Lemieux is closing in. Shot right on. Ford will grab it. Buck caught beneath his pads. And we'll get a face in. And Lupo for the face off. Off the draw. It's one back to Bruce. His shot blocked in front. Now Hotham battling for it in the left wing corner. It swung out to Gatsos. He's checked by Bruce. Chin now's after it. He'll grab it and poke it behind the goal to Greg Hotham. All right, Greg Hotham now with a puck on the right side to Gatsos. It's by him. And now accidentally cleared up into the Fredericton bench. We'll get a whistle now and a faceoff in the neutral zone with 2.35 to play here in the second period. 1-1 is our score. Elaine Lemieux with a goal in the first period for Fredericton. And the Jacks have countered here with a power play goal in the second period by Roger Belanger. All right, Chin facing it off with Lupo. Now Bruce took a swipe at Davy Simpson in the neutral zone with the Express with a puck. Here's Bruce now, checked by Greg Hotham. Hotham has the puck up to Colin Chin. 
Sheehan belted there and off the puck he goes. And Crawford's now has the puck. He'll loft it back to center. Alquist now to wait for his teammates to clear the zone. Chris finally grabs it and shoots it in deep in the express zone. Now Gatsos down the right side. To Simpson in front of the chin, but it was just off target. And now the express come back. Look out, Mark Crawford now. Into the Baltimore zone. Try to feed it over the left wing to Lupo, but that was broken up. Puck behind the goal now. Dahlquist trying to steer the puck out of danger. Ah, Chan knocked down behind the net. No penalty there. And they'll finally tie it up there for a faceoff. And Colin Chin now looks at referee Dan Montai and Tom O'Regan facing it off now with Mark Curtin left wing circle. Skip Jackson. It's back of it up point. Poudrier winds up, fires one. They save made there by Brian Ford. He got a piece of it. They knock it away. It's behind the goal now. And Bork will look for skating room. Here comes Phil Bork out to Tom O'Regan. And out of Giel on the right wing. Giel now into the zone. Taloni now. And Giel trying to get it back for Loney. Broken up. Now look out. Partial break. Moving into the zone. Here comes Curtin. Drop back for Huff. But Huff couldn't control the pass. Now it's center to God. Curry moving in. Shot score. Fredericton. Tony Curry at the side of the goal. Put it in by Brian Ford. And the Express regains the lead over Baltimore. It is Fredericton 2. Buck dropped, and Mark Crawford has it now. Up to Michelle Petit. Now into the zone to Crawford. Try to feed it right wing for Bruce, but that's stolen away with a skip. Jackson steered back to the Fredericton blue line. All right, back out at center now. Here's Belanche. Take it back to back to Nell. And now to Ralston at center ice. Here's Raleigh into the zone. He'll clear it around the horn. Now on the right wing boards, Belanche chasing it. He's checked by Andy Schliebener. Now the puck out at center on the stick of Dave Bruce. Here he comes. Dave Bruce into the zone with Lupo. Here's Lupo moving in. A shot from a bad angle there. Stopped in front. Now look out. Bruce taken down by Joe McDonnell. We got a penalty coming up here to the Skipjacks. We are back at the Civic Center. The Express on the power play now. Top of the circle, here comes Claude Julian now. Center point to Elaine Lemieux. Right wing circle, Lupul. Right point, Lemieux. Fakes the shot. Now the slot can't get a shot away. Far boards to Claude Julian. Now the right wing circle to Lupul. Now back to Julian. He'll take the drive, and that was fired wide of the goal. And the rebound will carry him all the way back into the Express zone. Ten seconds to go now in the period. The Express now quickly coming up ice now with four seconds left. Here's Claude Julian now with a puck. At the right point, wristing it toward the net. It's blocked in front. That hit Carlson. He's shaken up a little bit. Denell. So the Jacks still must kill off a minute 14 of Mac Denell's penalty. He received late in period two. Penalty killers for the Skipjacks, Steve Carlson and Colin Chin. On defense, Chris Dahlquist and Greg Hotham. Gary Lupul up front with Tony Curry on the right side. Mike Huff on the left side. Claude Julian. And Elaine Lemieux will play the points. Puck dropped. And we're underway now in period number three from the Civic Center. As the Jacks will shoot the puck into the Express zone. And now Elaine Lemieux will pick it up. Feeding it up ice to Huff. Here come the Express. Three on two. Huff into the zone. Left wing for Lupul. Holds on the break near boards. Now Lupul with a puck at the center point. Here he is. Right point to Julian. Left point to Elaine Lemieux. Lemieux now, side of the goal to Lupul. Here's Lupul closing in, shot blocked by Dahlquist. Lupul gets it back now on the far boards. Right point to Lemieux, back in the right wing circle to Lupul. Center point Lemieux. Right point Julian, center point Lemieux. Takes the drive, kicked out by Brian Ford. Loose puck, side of the net. And Ford will grab it there. And smother the puck head first, and we'll hang on for the faceoff here. And we'll drop the puck in the skip jack zone. 38 seconds of period number three. Face-off coming up to the left of goalie, Brian Ford. Carlson and Lupo for the draw. And they're moving in. Puck drop. Lupo drawing it back at the right point to Lemieux. Lemieux holding it up along that blue line, just barely keeping it in. Now Lemieux feeds it back, left point to Lupo. Lupo now with a puck. Right point to Lemieux, back to Lupo in the circle. Here's Curry, couldn't get a shot away in the slot. Curry now in the right wing circles. Got the puck for Fredericton. 
Center point now to Lupul. Now feeding it behind the goal. There is Elaine Lemieux. Far boards to Curry. Curry now holding it up. Now at the point. Here's Lupo, but a shot blocked by Carlson. He gets it back now. Right wing circle. Curry. Side of the goal. Elaine Lemieux. Here he comes. They're trying to stuff it in front, but a puck at the pad of Brian Ford. And he'll fall on the puck right there. Joe McDonnell back. Jack's back in action on Wednesday against Rochester. From the draw, Regan's pass goes behind Gia, but Gia will catch up with it, sliding it in front for a Regan. He tips it on the goal. But Young made the stop there. Now they stack it up. Right rear boards, O'Regan now. Here comes Lo Charlesworth coming in down the left side. A shot stopped by Wendell Young. Charles with a great chance there, cutting in down the left side. Now Gia hauls down Jean-Marc Golan, but the puck able to get to center ice. No Borks on it there, and he'll slap it in off the wood, back deep in express territory. And back to get it now, Andy Schliebener. On the right side, puck comes out to the slot, taken away now by the express, Michelle Petit over the line of Lafayette, but the express being called here on the offside. We have played a couple of minutes of period three, two to one, Fredericton has the lead. And this is Skip Jack's Hockey on AM 1230. We are back live at the Baltimore Civic Center. Baltimore now with a puck on their own zone. It comes Wally Weir to center ice. Try to swing it up on the left wing to Rissling. Stolen away by Tony Curry. Now Gatsos with a steal in the neutral zone. Weir grabs the loose puck and shoots it into the express zone. And back to get it now, Danielle Poudrier. He'll swing it up on the far boards. Now the express will bring it out. Here they come, two on two. With the puck, over the line, down the right side. It's Mark Curtin driving it in front for Poudrier. Knocked away by Gatsos. And up on the left wing to Gary Rissling. Rissling now carries the puck into the front of Tanan. Now on the right side for Simpson. His shot blocked on a good defensive play by Claude Julian. We are cutting in. Look outside of the goal. Slot to Gatsos. Couldn't tee it up. Puck squirts outside the line taken by Mike Huff. He'll cross the red line and fire it inside of the Baltimore goal. And Ford setting it up for Gatsos. Here comes Gatsos. Avoiding a check momentarily. Now getting around the man. Cutting in. Shot knocked down with a blocker. Of Wendell Young, Gatso's getting it back, but he's ridden off the puck by Schliebener. And here comes Fredericton now to Price. Gary Lupo with the puck across the Baltimore line. Look out, he's closing in down the left side, but couldn't get that final pass in. Now at the right wing boards, here is Petit with a shot. That's deflected wide of the net. Dahlquist will pick it up. And he'll shoot it outside the line. And we're going to get icing here. I don't know about that call. Randy Whistler signifying icing, and now they're going to... If Baltimore doesn't win, you'll probably see somebody else getting scratched on Wednesday. Let's hope that doesn't happen. All right, puck dropped off the draw. Shot goes wide of the goal. Now the near corner, Hoffman with a puck, shooting it up the near boards. Now Carlson, can he get it out? Yes, he will. Feeding it up ice, but it's stolen away there by Michelle Petit. Petit now, long slap shot from center. Ford knocks that down. Puck to flex to the left wing corner. Carlson and Crawford fight for the puck. Out on the near boards, but on Jane Loop will do the same. Finally, Carlson will dig it out and swing it over to the defenseman, Chris Dahlquist. Up to Ralston now, over the line of an Andre, but it hopped over a stick, and now the Jacks are being called here on the offside. Two to one. All right, Elaine Lemieux and O'Regan for the faceoff, and O'Regan wins it. Back of the defense, center ice, long slap shot in, gloved by Young. Now, John Mark Goldan will bag it off the wood, back into the skipjack zone. Here's Bork firing it ahead for Simpson and Otto O'Regan, right wing to Giel. Giel into the zone, will kick the puck down the right wing boards. O'Regan's got it now. Back for Giel, goes behind the goal. Here's O'Regan with the puck looking for it now. And he get back, left point Charles Ward. He'll slap it around the horn. Here's O'Regan now with the puck in the near corner. Ridden off the puck by Golan. Now here's Loney trying to stuff it in front, but a good defensive play there. Julian took it away. Now here's Loney at the center point. The wrist shot toward the goal. Gloved neatly by Wendell Young. And Poudrier will fire it off the glass. Kept in by the Skipjacks. Here's O'Regan now. But we get a hand pass called here against Baltimore and play whistled down in the... Baltimore's had some ups and downs this season, but unfortunately it's a little bit more on the downside. 
and it's been on the upside. All right, puck dropped in the Jacks have it now. Here's Gatsos. Fires the puck back to the Express Blue Line. And Petit going back to get it. Gave the puck to Rizzling on the left wing boards. Gary Rizzling now with the puck on the left wing circle. Now Gatsos has got it, looking for room. Gatsos now trying to drive one toward the goal off Petit. Petit goes back for the puck. Cleared around the near boards. McDonnell, can he hold it in? Yes, he will in a good play. Driving one toward the goal through traffic and just wide. And the puck finally comes back into the neutral zone. Weir fires it ahead. Curry knocks it down. Here's Tony Curry down the right side, but puck taken away by Colin Chin. Chin now. And it poke checked off his stick and back to the Fredericton Blue Line. Here come the express up ice now. Michelle Petit tried to feed it in for Dave Bruce, but it went back to center. And now Lupul's got the puck. Gary Lupul for Bruce off the wood. And by Mark Crawford, it'll roll into Baltimore territory, and Wally Weir going back to get it. Way up on the left side now to Simpson. His pass ahead out of the reach of Carlson. Back at the Express Blue Line. Poudre now. And over the line for Lupo, but a good hip check there by Chris Dahlquist. Took him off the puck. And now Crawford gathers it in. Here's Mark Crawford. He is checked. Puck back at the Express Blue Line. Right wing feed for Lupo. He's got it, and he'll fire the puck into the skipjack zone. Ward now steering it away from an on-rushing Mark Crawford. And now Dahlquist, good right wing pass on the stick of Ralston at center. Into the Fredericton zone, Ralston for Carlson. Here's Carlson now trying to drive it down the slot for Simpson. Going away by Poudrier, and here come the express back. Here's Mark Crawford to make that Bruce down the right side. In front for Crawford, closing in the shot kicked out by Brian Ford. And now Ralston heads back the other way quickly. Tom Ralston at center, into the zone, drop pass for Simpson. Simpson now back for Phil Bork. It's stolen away by Gary Lupul up ice. And out of Crawford. Into the skipjacks and Crawford now centers it out of the reach of Ken Quinney. When he goes back to get it now, tried to center one, or Regan blocked that. Now it's behind the Jacks goal, picked up by Phil Bork. Bork getting it out now on the left side of Simpson. Simpson now with a puck. Here he comes, and over the line. Simpson trying to get it down the right wing boards. Ralston now will grab it, fire one, that's blocked in front. Now they got behind the goal to O'Regan. He's wrapped up by Schliebener. Ralston in there now trying to keep it in. Working on the near boards. Can't hold it in. Here come the Express now. Three on one. Here is Quinney closing in. Shot save. Rebound batted away there. In front of the net. Now at the right point. Buck held in by McIntyre behind the goal, but Charlesworth has got it. Baltimore dodged the bullet there on a three on one. Fredericton break. O'Regan will tap the puck back to the Express Blue Line, but it's grabbed by Schliebener. He'll fire it in on goal. Brian Forge stopping it and leaving it off now for Wally Weir. Now Weir and Stevens get their sticks up. Puck outside the line. Here comes O'Regan over the line for Bobby Gia with the pass went behind him. He will chase it in deep in the Express end. He jams with Poudrier now behind the net. Here's O'Regan now going to stop it in front side of the net, but there's Wendell Young. And he'll hang on there for the faceoff. O'Regan tried to pop the puck in Alain Lemieux, the brother of the Penguin star, Mario Lemieux. All right, they're moving in. Puck is dropped. It'll go behind the goal. Picked up now by Claude Julian. Julian spinning away from Bobby Giel. Fredericton trying to get the puck out. Wally Weir holding it in momentarily, but now the Express come back. Here's Julian now, feeding it in down the right wing boards. It'll roll deep in Jack's territory. Now Ford couldn't get it out. It's back of the point to Julian. His shot right on. Glove by Brian Ford. He'll hang on there for the faceoff. Two to one. The Express with the lead over the Skipjacks here with 11.04 to play in the third period. And this is Skipjacks Hockey on AM 1230 WITH. All right, Skipjacks now, trying to get that puck out of their own zone. 
It's clear to the line, not off. Poudrier's shot deflected on the way to the goal there. And now Baltimore's got the puck. It's defenseman Wally Weir. Swing it up now to Loney. Into the zone. Down the right side for Aguil. Now back for Loney. Only tried to slide the puck in front to O'Regan. Couldn't do it. It is loose. Side of the goal now. Regan after it. Centers one. Nobody there but John Mark Goldan for Fredericton. And now the Express up ice. Into the skip jack zone. Here is John Mark Lanthier, but he's offside this year along with Claude Verrett. Goaltenders Jacques Cloutier and company. They'll all be here on Wednesday evening. Hope you'll make your plans. No school the next day for the kiddos, of course. The next day, Thanksgiving. Hope you make your plans to see the Jacks in Rochester. Here at the Civic Center, Wednesday evening, face-off time, 7.30. Rizzling now, trying to get it back behind the goal to Gatsos. Couldn't do it. And the Express now with a puck in their own zone. Here comes Mark Curtin now, wheeling out of his own zone. Left wing to Mike Huff. Pass on the money. Huff trying to split the defense. Can't do it. Puck deflected away, and Chin comes back. Down the left side. Chin tried to feed the puck in front to Rizzling, but it's broken up. And it'll be sent back to the Baltimore Blue Line, and Chris Dahlquist back to get it. Slides it over to Hotham. Now to Getzos. Now to Chin, feeding the puck into the zone. But he's given a good pop there at the penalty box area. And the Express now will grab the puck. Deep in their own zone. Up to Huff. He'll fire it back to center. Carlson will knock it down. And over the line for Rizzling, but it's just out of his reach. And now the puck taken away by Fredericton. Up ice now with a puck. Here comes Dave Bruce to give it a chase, but Charlesworth will beat him to it. And Rizzling now back at his own blue line. Fires it ahead, but it's taken away by Fredericton. Here comes Lupul across the line. Gary Lupul now trying to slide a three, but Gatso steals. Gatso's two on two with Ralston. Gatso's now with a puck. Sliding it through for Ralston, but stolen away by Mark Crawford. Crawford coming back now, three on three down the right wing. Here comes Crawford now, going to slide it in front. Look out, shot right on, it's kicked in. No goal, says referee Dan Marowelli. There's no way that one should have been allowed. It was definitely kicked in by Fredericton. And Marielli makes the call. No goal on that one. And any dummy could have called that, I'll tell you. As the Express did kick it in. Baltimore trying to get back in this one here. And off the faceoff, we get a false drop. And we'll have to do it all over again here. All right, puck drop. The Jacks have it now. Charlesworth swinging up left side on the sticker. Austin, he'll slap it into the Fredericton end. On the near boards, Belange chasing it, but it's out of his reach. Uh, Carlson steps in, trying to hold that puck in. Now Belange will grab the puck off the boards. Fire one toward the goal. Wendell Young making the save there. Finally, the Express bring it out, back to center. Charles Worsh slapping it back in here. Baltimore working hard, trying to get that tying goal. Now Bork at the point. Will slap it in behind the goal. Now here's Carlson. Back behind the net to Ralston. Ralston now trying to center one. Here's Carlson in front, couldn't get his stick on it. And now Jean-Marc Lanthier. Swing it over to Elaine Lemieux. Here he comes into Baltimore territory. Lemieux now on the slot. For Jean-Marc Golan. Golan will turn around. Fire one. That shot missed the net. Hamlet on Jay with a puck now. To Ralston at center. Hopped over his stick. And it's gathered in there by Mark Kurt. The Express now trying to get it out. Here is Belange. Can he hold it in? He does momentarily now. Curtin and Ralston tied up. Back at the Baltimore Civic Center while we're away. The Jacks have tied it up here at 2-2. Sure wasn't the prettiest goal in the world, apparently. It was a goal by scramble in front, and it... Well, let's see here. They will give the puck the goal, rather, to Joe McDonnell. His first goal of the season. O'Regan and Simpson getting assists. Time of the goal, 12-15. We're all tied up at two goals apiece. Well, the Jacks breathe a new life here. 
Here they come now, Tom O'Regan with a puck. Into the express zone, down the left side. The wrist shot glove by Wendell Young. And he'll hang on right there for the faceoff. I'd like to extend our greetings to Lorraine Kelly. Back home in Baltimore following some minor surgery. Up now at two goals apiece on the goal being credited to Joe McDonnell. All right, puck dropped. It'll go behind the goal, and here comes Claude Julian with it. Swing it up now on the right side. Julian, can he get it out? He will, but O'Regan tied him up. Now the Jack shoot it back in, but O'Regan was caught inside the zone. And that'll give us an offside here against the Skipjacks. But they've always been hustling and trying, and I think you've really got big problems when your team stops doing that, but that has not been the case with Baltimore. All right, here come the Express now. Shot down the left side, Gary Lupul. Stopped by Brian Ford. And now Gatsos with a puck in his own end. Tried to feed it up ice to Chin, but it was out of his reach, and it's back to the Express blue line. Petit, going to slide it in now down the left side. Here is Mark Crawford now in the slot today. Bruce is shot. Ford stops that in front. As Bruce picked up the bouncing puck. Now Gatsos trying to get it ahead to Rizzling, but it's batted back to center. On the stick of Dave Bruce coming down the right side. Here's Dave Bruce. He's checked by Todd Charlesworth. And now Gatsos up ice. Here comes Steve Gatsos now. Slapping it in on goal. Young will stop it and leave it for defenseman Michelle Petit. Pass up ice. Batted away there with the skipjacks. Golan looking for the breakaway there. Didn't get it. Not on the near boards. Here comes Bork. Can he hold it in? He cannot, but Ralston will. Firing it toward the goal. And that's stopped in front by Wendell Young. And now it's just cleared back to the skipjacks. Blue line and Phil Bork hustling back to get it. 6.05 remaining here. Period number three. We're tied at two goals apiece. Bork now in his own zone. Up the center of the ice to Carlson. Not a Bonanche. Here comes Bonanche into the zone. Here he comes, gets around his man, closing in, side of the goal, Ralston shot! He shoots and scores! Bonanche flips the puck over to Tommy Ralston, and he bats it in by goalie Wendell Young, and a couple of quick goals here with the Skipjacks, and they have taken the lead over Fredericton by a score of 3-2. to two. Well, the Express, and able to slide the puck over to Ralston, who batted it in by Wendell Young. And the Jacks now with the lead, three to two. So now the Express have to come back here. They'll shoot it into Baltimore territory. Charlesworth now with a puck. Up to Ralston. The Express hold it in now. In the up wing corner. Phil Bork with a puck. Out to Carlson. Here is Carlson, he'll backhand it in now, back behind the Express net. Let's see here, along the near boards, here's Belange trying to hold it in, but can't do it. The puck taken by Mark Curtin. Slap shot from the blue line, right on. Ford will grab it there, waist high. And hang on for the faceoff. 5.17 to go here in the third period. The Jacks have grabbed the lead over Fredericton. It's 3-2 Baltimore. And this is Skip Jacks Hockey on AM 1230 WITH. And then back with you at the Civic Center. Here's O'Regan now. Hooks the puck out of the Fredericton end. Julian now getting it outside the line, just out of the reach of McIntyre. It's back now at center, but look out. Here comes Scott Toddle. First time on the ice for him. He'll bring it in. But the Jacks are going to ice the puck here. They're going to fire it the length of the ice. And that's icing against the Skipjacks now with four. I'm almost sure Ralston got that in, so we may have a change here on the goal. The official score has given it to Belanger from Carlson and Bork, but let's wait and see if they change that. Ice off coming up here in the skipjack zone. Ken Quinney and Bobby Gio for the draw. As McIntyre and O'Regan were waved out. 
to the right of Brian Ford, skip Jack's own. They move again, puck drop. Weir now will get it over to McDonnell. Mack out of center ice now to Bobby Geel. Geel now with a puck. He'll dump it in down the right wing boards. Loney will give chase. Loney's got it behind the net. Here's Troy Loney out of Regan in front. Couldn't get on the puck. And now the Express will grab it. And here they come up ice. Quickly now, Ken Quinney into the zone now. Quinney trying to get around McDonnell, and he can't do it. Now it's loose, side of the goal. Quinney now after the puck, along with Scott Tottle. Tottle's got it, look out. The Poudrier, a shot save in front by Brian Ford. Loose puck pulled away there by McDonnell. Held in now. Poudrier now at the right point to Julian. By Julian, left point to Poudrier. He'll slide it toward the goal. McDonnell knocks it down to the line, not up. Poudre, look out, right point, Julian, here it comes, and a drive blocked in front by Loney. Poudre now getting it back, his slap shot toward the goal. Deflected up into the crowd, and we're going to get a face off here. This express power play. O'Regan in the penalty box for cross checking at 15.58. All right, Lupo, Curry, Huff up front, Julian, Lemieux at the points. Penalty killers for the Jacks, Carlson and Chin. Now Carlson waved out of the circle, and Chin will take it. Puck drop. Express has got it. Julian now, along the near boards, Tony Curry. Curry now holding it up. At the left point to Julian. Julian now, circle to Curry, driving it toward the goal. Shot right on by Huff, and the save by Brian Ford. Curry getting it back now at the point to Julian. To Curry in the circle, moving in, shot. And Hoffman got in the way of that to block it. Now Ford out of his goal to swing it up the far boards. But the Express still with a puck. Lupo now at the point to Lemieux. Back for Lupo. Center point Lemieux. Can't tee it up. Baltimore holding the express out here. Lemieux now with a puck. Right point to Julian. Center point Lemieux. Side of the goal, Lupo. Center point Lemieux. Side of the goal. Now it's back at the right point to Julian. Near boards, Tony Curry. Baltimore keeping the express off balance. Now Lemieux comes in top of the right wing circle. The shot blocked in front. As Chin and Huff collide, they go to the boards. Puck is dug out. Curry now, Lemieux, can't get a shot away. Now Lemieux at the right point to Julian, back for Lemieux, wait a minute here, whistle. And let's see here. Mike Huff and Chris Dahlquist. Each two minutes per high, sticking at 16.58. It's still gonna be a five on four power play here, Carlson and McIntyre for the face off. Hey, Jack's really playing that Penalty killing effort very well. All right, from the faceoff, Carlson wins it over to Chan. He'll fire it down ice. And the Express has to go back to get it here. Here they come up ice now. McIntyre will fire it in left wing corner. Baltimore and Hotham going behind the net. He'll find the opening. No, he doesn't. It's moving in. Shot right on for the save. Rebound. Look out, Lewis Puck, who's got it. Chin trying to clear. Couldn't do it. Express now with a puck, close call there. Here's Julian now. Top of the circle to McIntyre, back for Julian. Here comes the drive, it's blocked on the way to the goal by Chin. All right, now Lemieux with a puck. Tatano with the point, his drive, Ford with a stop there in front. Weir will find the opening and clear it down ice. Oh, the Jacks dodging several bullets there. Eight seconds to go on the power play. Here comes Lampier now into the zone. Lampier now in the slot. Here's McIntyre. Backhander, he scores. McIntyre ties it up with one second to go on the penalty to Tom O'Regan. He put a perfect backhander in the upper left-hand corner. All right, face off at center here. O'Regan and Curtin. Puck dropped. Now Gio trying to drop it back to his own defense, but Bork was cutting up ice, and so has to go back into his own end now. Bork. They'll fire it off the boards, back to center. Gee will pick up the bouncing puck, but now he overskates it. And it's back now to center. Gee after it there. It's cleared ahead to the Fredericton line. Now Regan down the right wing will poke it into the right wing circle, but Petit with a puck. Now Regan steals. Here's O'Regan now. Here he is beside the goal in front. Deloney can't get a shot away. We're at the point of shot save. And kicked out there by Wendell Young. All right, here's Lanthier now. End of Baltimore territory. Over for the team, but it's offside. And we'll get a whistle here. We're going to face it off outside. We are back live at the Baltimore Civic Center. 
Baltimore three and Fredericton three. 106 to go now in period three. Here's Wally Weir with a puck. Getting it up over the line to Belanche. As quick wrist shot stopped by Wendell Young from the Express Blue Line. Now here comes the Express, Dave Bruce. Over the line to Lupo. Lupo drop pass for Crawford. Right side to Bruce, but that play didn't connect. Now on the far boards, Julian holding it in. By Julian, checked by Ralston. Now Charles with a rush back. Two on two with Carlson. Charles with over the line. He's upended. No penalty there. Carlsworth upended and no penalty. Now Crawford with a puck. 32 seconds to go in regulation. Now Ralston behind the net almost had it. But taken by Poudrier. He'll fire it back to the center circle. Carlsworth now over to Phil Bork. He could not control it. Here comes Mark Crawford now with a puck. Crawford now in his own zone, out the center. He'll backhand it in, left wing corner, Baltimore end. Ralston will bang it off the wood, back to center. Ten seconds left here in regulation. Tony Curry now, feeding it in for Petit, but it's by him. It'll roll deep in the zone. And we get a whistle here, and the buzzer sounds, ending period number three. And so we're going to be heading for us. All right, they have indeed changed the goal. Baltimore's third goal, and it's been given to Tom Ralston. A face-off at center here. Baltimore moving left to right. A crusher down here in the five-minute sudden death overtime period. Carlson, Belanche, and Ralston up front. Dahlquist, Topham back of the fence. Lemieux. The face-off with Carlson. And the Jacks clear the puck ahead into the express zone. At the side of the goal, Poudrier with a puck. Spinning away from Carlson. Poudrier, pass up ice now to Golan. Stolen away by Carlson now in the zone. Here's Carlson firing it back deep, but wait a minute here. Offside call against the Skipjacks there. We'll face it off outside the Fredericton Blue Line here. We've played 16 seconds of sudden death overtime. We are tied at three goals apiece. You and Carlson for the draw. And Lemieux's got it. Check from behind by Carlson, but we're going to get it over to Lanthier. And he'll shoot the puck into the Baltimore zone. Hotham now behind his own goal. Trying to work the puck out and does so to Carlson at center. Now here's a right wing feed to Belanche. Romney rooming in, a shot wide of the goal. Now Dahlquist, can he hold it in? He'll drive it back behind the goal, but Poudrier's on it there. Swing it off the glass, back to center. Hotham now will shoot it right back into the express zone. And back to get it now, Claude Julian. And he'll swing the net and start it up. Pass ahead now, left side, Lanthier. Over the line to Curry, but Curry was checked by Wally Weir, and Carlson's got the puck. Four minutes left in sudden death overtime. Here's Steve Carlson now at center. Long slap shot, wide of the express goal. As Baltimore now changing up on the fly here. Here's Chin after the puck, but Curry's got it in the express end. Now Schliebener now behind his own goal. Andy Schliebener. Letting do start the rush now for Fredericton. Out of center ice now, Mike Huff off the handle. And now Chin will come in. Here's Chin upended, no penalty. Dropping it down the left side now for Gary Risling. Now Gatsos behind the goal. Boy, I tell you, Jack should have got a power play there. Now here's Huff. Can he get it out? He cannot. Gatsos now overskates the puck. Schliebener's got it. Andy Schliebener. To Petit and now to Mark Curtin. And he'll just loft it into the skipjack zone. Ryan Ford will swing it around the horn. Rizzling, can he get it out? He will. Out to Colin Chin. And now to Gatsos. Gatsos trying to flick it in for Chin over the line, but broken up there at the express blue line by Mark Curtin. And he backhands it in, left wing corner, Baltimore zone. After Dave Bruce, look out, got a man open, couldn't get it to him. Crawford open, but the centering pass stolen away with the skip Jackson, batted back to center. Lupo now will clear it in on goal, and Ford will dish it off to Loney. Loney is bumped by Bruce. Now the Jacks trying to work it out here. Here's O'Regan. Bounding it off the wood. Back to the Express Blue Line. Schliebener swing it over now to Julian. Julian for Fredericton. Pass ahead. Knocked down by O'Regan. O'Regan now will come right back. In down the left side. He'll dump it in deep. In the Fredericton zone. Now in the near corner. Here comes Simpson trying to hold that puck in. It's gathered out though by the Express. And now Mark Crawford will come to center. Here comes Mark Crawford now. And over the line. Crawford. Cutting in down the right side, trying to get around Charlesworth, he couldn't do it. Now they stack it up, right rear boards, Baltimore zone. Now the puck comes free as Loney begins to push and shove with Gary Lupo. Now Charlesworth comes in there. 
And the linesman finally had the players separated here. All this coming with 2.07 to play in the sudden death overtime. Mark Crawford and Troy Loney with their sticks up. If the Jacks could get it. All right, Lemieux and O'Regan now for the draw. All right, it's loose in the circle, gathered in now by Dahlquist, and he'll neatly backhand it to center. Julian will pick it up. Off the boards, Loney will knock it down, fire it into the Fredericton end. It's on goal, stopped there by Young. And now here come the express up ice. Lanthier will cross the red line and clear it back into Baltimore territory. Ryan Ford leaving it for Dahlquist. And now up ice, here comes Tom O'Regan, two on two. With Simpson trailing. Here's O'Regan now, cutting down the left side. Now putting on the brakes, Julian checked him. They stack it up now. Now Simpson after that puck. They jam up, left wing corner. Now we get a whistle, we're gonna face it off here. In the Fredericton zone with a minute 33 to go here in the overtime. Fred Curtin Carlson for the draw. To the right of Wendell Young. All right, puck drop, Ralston top of the circle, fires one save, rebound! Just cleared away from the doorstep there by Wendell Young. Now it goes behind the goal. Curtin going to swing up the far boards. Weir couldn't hold it in. It's back to center. All right. McDonnell will poke it in, but an offside call there against the Skipjacks. So we're going to face it off here outside the Express Blue Line. Actually just inside the Fredericton side of center red with 118 to play. And sudden death overtime. If neither team can score, this one will go into the books as a 3-3 tie. Carlson, Curtin again for the draw at center ice. Junior Briaco pacing nervously behind the bench. Puck drop, McDonnell, McDonnell will poke it into the express end. And back to get it now, Petit. He'll just fire it all the way down the ice. This will be icing here against Fredericton as McDonnell goes back to get it. He touches and icing call right of Wendell Young. We're tied at three with 1.03 to go here in sudden death overtime. Jack sure haven't won many games in overtime the last couple of years. It'll be good to get one here. All right, Carlson and Curtin moving in. Here is Julian trying to clear it. Cannot do it. Wendell Young now out of his own goal. Will fire the puck ahead at center ice. It's back now at the blue line. Huff after it. And now it's gathered in by... Poudrier, he'll clear it back into the skipjack zone. 46 seconds left. Pass ahead to Carlson. Now he'll feed in Ralston down the left wing, and Raleigh will give it a chase deep in the express end. Now it comes out to the left point to Wally Weir. He cannot hold it in. Look out, the express come back, two on two. With the puck now, Mark Curtin. Down the slot, Poudrier fires away, but it's blocked in front there. By Belange. Here come the Jacks back. Ralston now, and over the line, drop pass for Carlson. Back for Ralston, here he is, shot from a sharp angle. And Young knocked that down with 18 seconds left. In the near corner now. Here's Carlson trying to keep it alive. It's behind the net, away from Ralston. Now Dahlquist kind of trying to hold it in. He'll do so. Back behind the goal to Ralston. Five seconds left. Here's Raleigh now, tied up there by Poudrier. Two seconds to go. They slide the puck up the near boards. Buzzer sounds. Game is over. Well, the Jacks do...